23 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on the East Coast in the United States of America. I'm T Speaker 222 XRP Future Millionaire with the side bet on XLM and Future Digibyte OG. So I want to thank you guys. And it's 9:23 a.m. as we've mentioned. We look like we were on top yesterday when we were saying that we could possibly have a retest pushing up. And Bitcoin could possibly be in a bull flag. It held last night. And I think, or I mean, uh, XRP might be in a bull flag. And I think, like I was targeting out, I think it gets up to here. We have this. I think it's going to come up here before we have to decide exactly what's going on. And it doesn't seem like a big move, but that's another 2.03% up. I think that we have to, that's in the five minute, but if we go to the 30 it really looks like we need to pull up here off this bull flag. If we can break out of this region, then you would look right here. Would be your upper end target, unless we can clear this section. So if the bull flag breaks up, you've got 2% to there, about 4% to here. But if you can break out of this bull flag and get up to 85,367, or 347 would be the approximate target. We just gotta get out of this V uh, reversal. And we've come back into the channel, which is fantastic news. And now we need to bounce out of this bull flag, which overnight the integrity has been holding across the board. Bitcoin's at 40,993. Again, I thought Bitcoin was gonna pull up out of this bull flag. I haven't made any secrets about it. I thought at minimum we'd retest 41,266. And then if we can break that, we can actually have the integrity of this bull flag stay. And this could be a pretty substantial, not substantial, but it could be a pretty nice move. And I'm going to do this, you know, I'm not going to do this the entirety of the bull flag because I don't want to give up any hopes. But we're going to say the bounce started there. And that would get us to about 42,457 on Bitcoin. So that's what we're looking at for Bitcoin. Can we get up there to the top? And then we look for some symmetry and it makes sense because that's the top of our symmetrical triangle. So we're close to the top of the symmetrical at 43,350 area. So 42,457 is what I think might happen today. And for that, I went into Filecoin last night, got into a long position, gave myself plenty of room when I was sleeping for a stop loss so I wouldn't get kicked out. And it came within three cents of kicking me out still. And I'm gonna show you guys my position. I, I, leave, I alerted my telegram when I went into this position last night. I did a 20X. It's showing 17.68, but it's 20x if it, it, it goes up and down. Um, at $19.55, I put a stop loss at $19.37 because I didn't want to get kicked out while I was sleeping. If it retraced, and I put it to the, the uh, market low for the segment, and it was $19.39. So I went two cents below the market low, you know, in the, the range, and it went down to $19.39, $19.40 when I slept. So now it's back up to 1967, a buy-in price of 1955. And you guys are probably like, well, what's your target? My targeted move is $20.39. If it can somehow break out of that, then we're talking. But first moves first, we got to break 1974 resistance. And we have $19.58 as support. It's just we've got to break out of this area. But that is a bull flag in my opinion. And I started it at what appears to be the low right now. So where i said it was going to push up so we're going to see uh because we came down wick but now if we break out of this area right here it's actually a little bit higher but i still like that twenty dollars and 39 cent target that's what i'm doing that's my trade right now i went 20x long on file at 19.55 so up about 13 14 percent right now so not too shabby and i put 800 bucks towards it so it was a sixteen thousand dollar trade with the 20x leverage so xlm 203 again if xlm holds this integrity we had nice retraces overnight so i mean if we hold the integrity and we're gonna we're gonna do it conservatively because uh 
We want to make sure we can hit our targets. And look at how perfectly these are going to work out. This gets you right to the top of the channel for uh, top of the symmetrical for XLM. So, I mean, that's a beautiful retest. So, I'm pretty sure that's what's going to happen with XLM. And then we go to DGB. And then I'm going to let you guys go because I think this is an incredibly important update this morning. DGB is in the same situation. It's finishing this V. We're going to see. It already came up to 2616, which we talked about on the drop, that it would be a healthy retrace. Now, if we can push up and hold this, we should be able to double top here at 2.6. That's what we're going to watch for today. Stay blessed, everybody.